Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you how to get the tactical map onto your second monitor. Now, Battlefield 4 has a very funky little feature. This is called Battle Screen. Basically it allows you to put the tactical map, or the large tactical map anyway, onto another display, uh, d d device, display, whatever. So you can put it onto a tablet, let's say you can put it on your iPad, you could put it on your Nexus 7, you could put it on your laptop, whatever you want. But for me, I think it really works the best when it's on your second monitor. It just gives that, like, I don't know, I, I, I felt like I was in some sort of um, command center, as cheesy as that sounds. In fact, it brought back memories of Supreme Commander for me. Now, if you, any of you guys have played that out there, you could have a, uh, like, the big strategic map. It looked amazing. You could see all the nukes flying. It just looked awesome. This is the same sort of vibe I'm getting, and it, yeah, it, it <laughs> I quite like this, guys. So, I'm going to show you how to set this up. It's very, very simple. Okay, so the first thing you've got to do is join a server via battle log. Then you'll notice a blue bar across the bottom of the uh, the browser window. Now, what you need to do is move the browser window to the monitor you're going to actually want the, the big map on. So obviously for me, I'd move it from my main monitor to my other monitor, so I'd drag it to the left sort of thing. Now, as the game loads in, so you have to wait for the game to load before this pops up, a little button will pop up on that blue bar and it will say battle screen. What you want to do is click that and it will uh, basically display the tactical map in the web browser. Now, what you should do after that to make it a little bit better, a little bit smoother, a little bit more fancy, is press F11 on your keyboard. Now, for Chrome, and I think this is the same for other browsers, but definitely for Chrome, which is the browser I use, it makes it full screen. So, all of a sudden, you've got a full screen map and it looks like this. Absolutely amazing. So, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty funky. And like I said earlier, it does bring back memories of uh, Supreme Commander to me. Well, for me, anyway. But I, yeah, this just looks crazy. I mean, I could, uh, I can see myself having that on all the time because I just like the fact that I can quickly look across and I can see pretty much everything that's going on. You could say, okay, it's duplicate information because yeah, you know, you you can see I've got the little, the little map, you know, uh, the mini map even in the bottom left of the screen on my main monitor, then I've got the big massive map, but I tell you what, it just adds another dimension to the game for me, I just, I don't know why, I just absolutely love it. So hopefully guys, this has been a, uh, a useful guide to you lot, and uh, if you want to set up your, if you have dual monitors, then go ahead and set it up like this, because it's absolutely fantastic. As I say, if you can also use your tablets or another laptop, say, in fact, I bet it works quite well on a laptop. Anyway guys, there you go, this has been how to use uh, Battle Screen on a dual monitor setup. I've been Silosa. If you like the video, then like the video. If you love it, then subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you next time, people. Toodaloo.